morning, everybody. Back in the car today. Uh, I've had kind of a busy morning. Um, had to drop off the dogs at the vet to get their dental work done today. And then we went over to do our uh, visit with Susie and Papa. Um, <clears throat> and now we're headed back home. But I also had to run to the grocery store because um, everybody should know I take great pride in my baking and my cookies, which are actually my mother's cookies, are um, famous. She is famous back home for her cookies, and I'm making a name for myself, so to speak, uh, here in the DFW area with her cookie recipe that I like to uh, vary on occasion. So anyway, last night was our first uh, attempt, uh, first using our new, new house oven, the oven in our new house. And I think one of my ingredients was bad or something like that. So instead of having actual cookies, you know, flat, normal looking cookies, I had uh, cookie balls. They never change shape from when you ball up the dough and put it on the, on the tray. Anyway, I had to go to the grocery store and get all new ingredients. So I'm going to attempt to make cookies again this afternoon. Um, and hopefully it's not something to do with the stove temperature because I really don't want to have to do the work to like recalibrate it and all that kind of stuff. So anyway, let's uh, get this vlog started, huh? It's all right, we're home and having lunch. Dogs are the vet, so I'm gonna have to clean up this mess myself today. You about ready for a nap, kid? I'm gonna. No? I'm gonna stay up for a few more hours? Attempt number two at the cookies, not entirely a fail, but also not correct. I realized pretty quickly that they were not gonna spread like they were supposed to, so in an effort to avert the uh, cookie ball disaster of last night, I pulled out a spatula and flattened the cookies so they would bake all the way through. Um, they have a cakey consistency, which is Sarah coined the term in regards to these cookies. Uh, these came out pretty similar. They still taste good, but they're not quite right. So it's back to the drawing board. I think I've got to have to buy an oven thermometer temperature thing and um, calibrate the, the temperature on my oven now. <laughs> Took a really good whoop. Took a really good nap. <laughs> Ready to get mama? <laughs> Alright, let's go get mama. Don't worry. You just hand it to me. 
All right, we got Mama. Now it's time to go get the puppies. Little Tron has some teeth pulled today. We're gonna get him some doggy dentures. Hey! <laughs> We're all home. Gabriel is having an appetizer of yogurt. Charlie has already finished his food. The Troners is having his. Poor Tron. Come here, bud. Go in the wrong direction. Hey, come up here. Do you want to take a bath? I've got fish and bubbles. I've got bubbles in the tub. <coughs> come see the bubbles. Come see the bubbles. <coughs> Gabriel, don't let your daddy. <laughs> Well, y'all, he is in a mood, so we're going to call the video right here. Sarah's giving him a bath, and then we're going to put him down for the night, but he's, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. He was in the car with me, and I think I was in the car for, uh, we, I think I figured it up to be about an hour this morning between driving the dogs and then driving Sarah and then driving to Susie's and driving home. It was a lot of driving. And then throw in the grocery store in there, so it was kind of a pain. So we're both kind of beat, I guess, but he's in a... He's a little cranky, little cranky Gabriel tonight. So Sarah's giving him a bath and then we're going to put him down for the night. So thank you all for watching. If you uh, haven't checked out our partner channel, Growing Roots, you ought to do that. They're a great family. They make great videos. Uh, it's just started a new series on Saturdays. That's a lot of fun. So you got to go check it out. I'll put a link in the corner. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. <music>